Liam just woke up from his nap and so we're going to do a diaper change and so I thought that I would show you guys our um, cloth diaper setup. He is on his changing table, if I could step away real quick. <laughs> on his changing table that's an old dresser, we just set this changing mat up there. Shh. And um, right beside it we have a long basket and in the basket I have his cloth wipes. Underneath it is disposable wipes which we rarely use, so that's why they're on the bottom. He has his cloth diaper wipe solution. Um, I can put in the description what all that's made up of. This thing just fell down. Okay. And then his baby lotion that we put on him after every bath. His Tylenol with a syringe, just in case he's fussy. A thermometer. Um, some... Um, Binkies, like the little holders, we use those in the morning, and his nasal syringe. So that's all in this thing. Now beside it, I have a um, little rolling plastic drawer thing, <laughs> um, and on top of it, I put his extra um, wet bags that go in his diaper pail, and then in this, this top drawer has like random hats and stuff. But in the second drawer, he's got his nighttime diapers, which have um, are double stuffed. And then in this drawer, I have extra inserts. And then I don't think there's yeah, there's nothing in that drawer. But um, so that's that. And then above him <laughs> is I put some baskets on the wall. I just um, they have little hooks that I got from Walmart that are basically like tacks with hooks on them. Let's see if I can these out. Let's see, these little tacks that have hooks on them, and so I put a couple of those across and then hung these baskets on it, and they work perfect for holding diapers. I could put five in here at a time, and so I have ten always up in here. Um, so, yeah, that's it as far as his cloth diaper station. So, I'm gonna go ahead and change him real quick. Okay, so he's ready to be changed. I just opened his onesie real quick so I don't have to do it with the phone. Shh. He just woke up. Come on. You're okay. Okay. So then we just undo this and I have a wipe, a cloth wipe that this is just flannel, a piece of flannel that I cut. Obviously it's not hemmed or anything. And I just wet it a little bit with the cloth diaper solution. And just take this bottle syringe and then do a little bit on the cloth wipe. Um, some people put it in spray bottles and spray it directly onto the baby, but I don't. Okay, so I'm going to wipe him down real quick. I wanted to show you guys real quick. He had a little redness on his butt. So in this top drawer where I keep his socks and his pajamas, I also keep this little box where I keep his tea tree oil, which I drop a couple drops of this in his um, diaper pail to help with stench. I have some vapor rub, some nasal drops, and uh, his diaper cream. And so since his butt's a little red, I'm going to use this. We only use California Baby because it's acceptable to use with cloth diapers. You want to make sure that your cloth, um, I mean your um, diaper rush cream is okay to use with um, cloth diapers because if you use like desitin, it can cause your um, diapers to start repelling and you'll have to strip them. So we use California Baby. Grandma L's is also good. Um, I'll put in the description what you want to look for um, in your diaper rush cream so you guys can know. So I put the diaper rush cream on his little booty and now I'm just going to put on his diaper. Since these are already stuffed, all I have to do is lay them underneath him and strap it on like a normal diaper, which I can't do with one hand. So, that's on now. Say hello, Liam. Hello. <laughs> so he's good and changed, and that's basically it. Um, when I'm finished with the diapers, um, I put them in the diaper pail. I just throw the wipe in there, unstuff the diaper. This is hard to do one-handed. And if it has Velcro on it, all we do is turn it inside out and Velcro it to the strip in the front. And then I also like to take 
my enzyme spray that I made. I can make a link to that so you guys can know. It's basically like, um, I think it's called BioClean or something like that. But I spray that on the diaper before I put it in. So that also helps with stench. And that's basically it. We're all changed now and hopefully happy, huh? Maybe. If you guys have any questions or would like to just comment, please do down below. And don't forget to subscribe. Until then, see you guys later.